Mm. You be trippin'. Hey, trippers. This is Trippin' Tracy. Today's trip brings us to my home base. We're gonna talk about coffee. The first kind of coffee I'm gonna talk about is my favorite, and that is Kuju coffee. Everything I need to make a cup of coffee except for the water is right in this packet. smells so good and then you just put it on like this with the little tabs on the side I got some hot water that I just heated up in the microwave now in my van I will use my electric kettle now like I said it does take a few minutes I don't know maybe a minute and a half I've never timed it it's kind of like my ritual in the morning now. You did it! Congratulations! World's best cup of coffee. I'll enjoy my Kuju coffee as I talk about these other ways to make coffee on the road. Mm. Okay, I need to stop. <laughs> this is the medium roast breakfast blend by Kuju, and I love it. I also like the dark roast. The light roast is a little too light for me. If I run out of Kuju coffee... Are you telling us absolutely everything? Not exactly. We're also out of coffee. <laughs> I use these filters. It's the same type of filter that Kuju uses. I don't know if it's the same company that makes them or not, but I found them on Amazon. I'll put the link below if you're interested. And uh, what I do is I just use my own coffee with these. If all else goes awry, I always want to have a backup to, to make coffee. Originally, my backup system was this AeroPress, which I was very impressed by. I used this on my camping trip up north in the Smokies the first time I went camping up there, and it works great. I was very happy with it, easy to wash, easy to use. I ordered this AeroPress off of Amazon and I'll put that link below if you're interested. It came with six pieces. These two pieces are basically like a French press. There's a filter piece on the bottom. Uh, it holds a little paper filter. Filters that it comes with initially and a filter holder. Something to stir. This piece, it's like a filter. I think maybe you can maybe get a different type of filter to put in here. I, I'm not sure. I never use this. You put the paper filter in you take it and you just twist it on there's a little locking mechanism on the bottom here and and then you put it over your coffee mug you put your coffee in here and then you pour hot water in after you put the coffee in the water and there you stir it up and then you take this piece and basically it's like a french press again you just push it down cleanup is easy all you do is twist this off the bottom I'm very happy with this. I was going to use it as my backup until I recently saw they have a new version of AeroPress. And look at this neat little travel case. Everything comes in this case. Now this travel AeroPress is a little bit smaller so you won't get quite as much, but that doesn't really matter to me. I would rather have this compact version that I can put somewhere in my van not worry about all these different pieces or putting them in a bag where they're still kind of bulky and and awkward let's take a look inside this travel aeropress it's a flexible top a tiny filter case for the round filters and you know if you're going to be going on a hike or uh, a short road trip and you only need so many then you would use this again you have this filter piece that goes on the bottom this is a little bit smaller, but it's the same functionality. Let's see what else we have in here. 
a scoop for some coffee, something to stir with. This is great because everything is in one carrying case. You would put one of the white filters in here, attach it to the bottom, put it on your mug, put your coffee in here, pour hot water in, do the same thing. And then you have your cup of coffee. It's very easy to use. And like I said before, I haven't cleaned this one yet, but I'm, it's the same thing. So it's gonna be super easy to clean. Everything is so compact and in this little case that you can also use as a mug. Let's try and get this back together because I always have a hard time putting things back together. Let's see how easy it is. And put our little spoon and our stirrer in here. Put it back on here like this. see. Wow. Very easy. It's ideal for van life, camping, hiking, uh, anything having to do with the outdoors. I highly recommend it. It's, it's awesome. This will be my backup system in case I ever run out of Kuju coffee and I don't have these little filters on hand. And you never know, this might become my primary way to make coffee. And if it does, I will let you know. How do you make your coffee when you're in your van or you're camping? I would appreciate your comments down below. Maybe you have a better way to make coffee. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. That helps me out on YouTube. And don't forget, subscribe if you haven't already. With that, I will bid you adieu and to stay trippy. Oh, hmm, hmm, oh. <laughs>